Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, WeatherTech, Hum by Verizon, RockAuto.com, and State Farm. Unless you've been living in a cave for the last 20 years, you've certainly heard terms like uh, smart mobility, V2V -V or vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communication, and autonomous automobiles and things like that. Well, these are all things that are becoming reality very quickly. And as they become reality, you're going to find that your vehicle may need some different services. Not the least of which is cleaning services. Now, here's what I'm talking about. A lot of modern cars have cameras. Cameras for lane keeping and different things like that, the autonomous braking functions and so on. And those cameras are often mounted inside the car up behind the rear view mirror. Now, what that means is that as the windshield, the inside of the windshield gets dirty, it may block the signal that those cameras are looking for. And if you happen to be a smoker, that brown film that builds up, we've seen some of these where it completely shuts down these systems because the windshield is too clouded with the tobacco and smoke residue and the system just shuts down. All right, now, not all of these things are inside the car. A lot of them are outside the car. Like on this Mercedes, we have sensors in the front bumper to read things ahead of the car. We have sensors in that star in the center of the grill. Now that means that these things need to be kept clean too. Now, if you happen to live in a, an area where you get salt and snow and so on, well, the snow and ice can build up over these sensors and you get false readings. And the other thing, even if you're not in an area where you have snow, they still have to be kept clean because mud and dirt and road debris and all, it can block these sensors. So you have to keep all of these things clean in order for these systems to work. And that brings up another point. Don't give up your good driving skills. Just because you have blind spot doesn't mean you still shouldn't look over your shoulder to make sure there's nothing in that blind spot. None of these systems are infallible, so you have to make up the, the safe part of all of this. And if you have a question or comment, drop me a line right here at MotorWeek.